Hey guys, and welcome back to Cameo. When we last left off, we were in the Badlands and we were looking for fruit. So, we've come up against some more huts, which is excellent, because huts generally involve fruit. So, let's have a little look inside, shall we? See what we've got to work with. Ooh. Uh, we have some shielded fellows. Well, that's easy. Kind of. Although, not really. Not a fan of these shielded guys. Damn it. Stop knocking my balls around. You dick. Right, hopefully. Damn, trying to get them behind these guys is not easy. There we go. That'd do. Carnage! Although, not really. Shit. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Boom! Shred your ass, boy. Um, okay. Well. I don't think we're going to get an awful lot out of this place. To be honest, I mean, we've got one of those, but we can't open that yet. Not with what we have. We are missing the required uh, elemental warrior. So, we'll come back to this one. Now, interestingly enough... Interestingly enough, this says... Are set up from here. Found in a stone chest in the right hut of the two northeast. Yes, okay. So at least we found this one. We just can't come back here until we have another warrior. I think I know what warrior we need. Uh, but I don't know when we get that one. But that's cool. We can still have a look in the huts anyway. Because you never know. Hopefully, we can find some money. So what's in this one? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Hopefully something cool. Hmm. We've got a whole lot of nothing in here by the look of things. Ooh, we can go down. Well that's kinda cool, I guess. Well, 230 odd runes, which is nice. Now, I can't remember if there was anything left to buy at the shop. The note is illegible. It seems uh, as though whoever wrote it was shaking too much to write properly. Damn, that ain't no good. Now, well, hopefully, we've got some more stuff in here. Oh. Before you can take this alternate skin, you'll have to find an elemental warrior that can wear it. I don't remember that guy. That's quite cool. Looks like a Vi uh, Venus flytrap or some shit. Looks like a mean motherfucker. Anyway, let's go downstairs. Hey, wait a minute. This tunnel is sealed. That ain't no good. Ah, the lost ruins. Cool. So we have another challenge. That's fine. We can handle another challenge or ten. At least we can pick up some coins on the way. We can never have too many coins, apparently. I'm sure we'll find something cool to spend our money on. Uh, it, doesn't, it doesn't seem quite slow, to be honest, to actually gather coins. Which is quite interesting. Wish it... Um, I wish you got a few more. Maybe we do, like, later on in the game. But having said that, I don't think there's, like, a massive amount of stuff to even buy in this game, to be honest. But I guess it matters not. I can't remember how many coins we can actually hold anyway, to be honest. Like, we have this uh, massive sack, which we can hold, like, massive fruit and God knows what inside. But we can't hold uh, a handful of, like, small coins, which is interesting. Zelda actually did the same thing. Ah, yes. The Wind Waker. One of my favorite games. Love that game. Hello. You'll need to keep in fighting form if you're to survive. 
Why not hone your skills with a challenge? Sounds good to me, Milado. Beetle Brawl. Well, I don't like beetles. In the game, they're kind of annoying. These are the rules of the challenge. Make sure to stick to them, as I'll be keeping a. Wow! So we got to destroy uh, at least 120 beetles within the time limit to win a prize. Use any move of any warrior, but don't leave the arena. Hmm. Okay. Well, we've got plenty of coins. I think we are going to use rubble, and hopefully. Yeah, I think that's going to work just fine. Also, I have the rune that gives us more stamina loaded. Oh, I don't know, guys. It's going to be close. Yeah, this is... Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe. At least our stamina is actually, like, regening pretty quick. Come on, we need some more of these guys to spawn in. Nope, that's kind of not what I wanted, but actually super effective nonetheless. Super effective. I think there's only three challenges in the game, or at least around here anyway. Oh man, we're hosing these guys down. Come on. Boom. Oh, yeah, we got it. We got it. That was actually really fucking close, to be honest. That's actually really close. Take this reward for a job well done. Cheers, buddy. No. Mm. All right, be on your way. But remember, you won't improve your skills if you don't practice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got it. To be fair, Milado, we've just like smashed your challenges. So I'm not gonna like panic the too much about it. Rounds up your progress so far. Um, I keep losing my pen. My cat keeps knocking my pen around. So, Northeast Heart leads to Beetle Brawl. We've done that. Small fruit. Small. Cool. We've got that one. So, there's actually like only one bit of fruit left. The Southwestern Right Hut. Ah. Southwestern, right heart of the pair. Okay, so we didn't go to that one. How interesting. So we actually do apparently have one more challenge to do. Excellent. We like our challenges. It, there we go. We really like our challenges. Oh, I suppose also here we can get our flame on. I hope to get some more coins. Nice. And uh, I was actually watching the Nintendo Direct as well, the E3 one, so let's date stamp this video. And uh, I actually got really excited because we saw Banjo and Kazooie, but it's a character for Smash Brothers. I actually really don't like Smash Brothers, uh, to be honest. I know that's probably like unpopular, but I, I don't get it. Like, I honestly, I've played it, it's, I, I don't know, I, I don't understand, I, I play it for like 10 minutes, not even 10 minutes, that's, 10 minutes is generous, I play it for a, a, a couple of minutes and I'm bored shitless, um, admittedly I've only played it on the GameCube and the Wii, but yeah, it's, it's just one of those games I just don't understand, like what people see in it. But hey, like each their own and all that kind of stuff, I suppose. But then I'm very, I'm very hit and miss with Nintendo anyway, to be honest. Like, I'm just really not that much of a Nintendo fan. I like Pokemon. I like Pokemon quite a lot. Um, very interested to see what Sword and Shield's like. Haven't actually brought a Pokemon game or played a Pokemon game since. Um. Holy shit. Like the remake of Red and Blue on the Switch was no not the Switch, twat. The um DS. Holy crap. Um, 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 um it's not there we want to go, is it? 
Where were... Ah! It was over here. I'm trying to remember where the bloody hut was then for a minute. So yeah, interested to see what Sword and Shield's like. Luigi's Mansion. Um, yes, Luigi's Mansion 3. Kind of interested towards for that as well, to be honest. Luigi's Mansion, the first game. I never played the second game. But the first one on the GameCube is one of my favourite games. I love Luigi's Mansion. When it first came out, everybody hated it. And I don't know why. It was so cool. I think it's because everyone wanted the cube to launch with a Mario game. Which, yeah, fair. Fair enough. Fair enough. It should have. But I fucking love um, Luigi's Mansion. I really did. It was so good. Painfully underrated. Right, we've been to that one. There should be two huts here, apparently. Now, we know that we can go off the edge there. Is the second hut, like, behind this one? No, because we can't get... We can't get a horse friend. Over there. Can we go up here? No. How bizarre. We should be able to... We know we can't go off the edge because, you know, we die. Which is a little bit awkward, to be honest. Um, Look at these siege weapons they've got. Crazy. Where the hell? What it says... Which is quite interesting. The southwestern... Southwestern right hut of the pair leads to two warrior trainers. Oh. The right hut of the pair. Well. Apparently, this guy has two challenges. The elemental one. I remember now. The elemental one. We can only do that when uh, we have all the warriors. I remember. Okay, cool. So let's get out of here. We've basically plundered the Badlands for everything we can get. Yeah. Oh, and they announced that Elder Scrolls Blades is coming to the Switch. Yay. Oh my god. Alien Isolation coming to the Switch though. Alien Isolation is an amazing game. And if that game can sell a million more units, which probably not uh, I'm all for it because that is a painfully under underrated game considering how well like uh, other survival horror games have sold and oh excuse me I've been at work all day um, and Alien Isolation really is up there with the best of them for sure Okay, let's go in. Let's go! Go for maximum penetration. In the hall. This game actually has a little bit of an old school Zelda vibe to it. That waterfall looks terrible actually. Yeah, my favourite Wind Waker is... My favourite Wind Waker. My favourite Zelda is probably Wind Waker. Hmm, so where are we? It did say. Like, literally flashed up for a second and I didn't read where we are. Ah, this is going to be Mountain Falls. Like, obviously. <sighs> Mountain Falls. There's quite a lot of, like, yeah, Mountain Falls. There's quite a lot of lore in this game as well, which is crazy, really. Warning, avalanche ahead. Pyrotechnic expert needed to light the fuse of the boom root plant. Boom root plant. That's just so rare. Well, we have a pyrotechnic expert. 
Really? Why do we have to be a pyrotechnic expert to do this? Wow. I say that's quite the fuse on that thing. <gasps> I remember this place! Oh, I love this place! Oh my god, it looks freaking beautiful! Hey, buddy, who have you got in you? Ah! That's Major Ruin, and he's just what we need to get around this rocky landscape. Chase down the Shadow Troll and destroy it. Oh my god, guys. Something that you lot might not know about me. When I play platformers, say Mario, Sonic, that sort of thing. Um, I love a good beach, like seaside kind of area where you've got a good bit of water. You've got the sand, you've got the steel drums. I love that. This looks fantastic. Welcome to the Mountain Falls. I'm Pacifica, Pacifica. Part of the Welcome Committee, so feel free to ask me anything. You got it. You look like a weird squid thing. My friends ran off and left you. Your friends ran off and left you? Oh no. That's no good. Let's go have a swim, shall we? Let's go swim. Hello, can you talk? Move it, buddy. Move it, buddy. How very dare you. Son of a bitch. I think we should go get a shadow troll, maybe? You know, I do want to kind of try and get some more fruit, but it's an addiction, I tell you. Ooh! Rufus House. We can't... Can we not... Can't kill these things. Can we not? No, I guess we need, we need a different beastie to fight these, I guess. Well, we need to do something first. Perhaps. Alright, let's get out of here. Let's go. She's gonna get her ass handed to us. Ah, oh, there should be a shop here. This person. I like the way you, like, sink straight to the bottom. I'm doing this on my own right now. Since the others all ran off when the trolls attacked, they're all a bunch of cowards. Mmm. Water trolls. Under certain circumstances, <sighs> trolls can heal themselves. For example, a plant troll sprayed with water, or an ice troll in freezing wind. That's actually really good to know. Hmm. Well, okay then. Good to know. Alright, um... Um, didn't really want to pick that, but sure. If you must know, I'm teaching my son to swim. He's a bright kid, but it's hard for him to live up to the legacy of an expert swimmer like me. Right. Didn't really care, but cool story, bro. Tell it again. Actually, don't tell it again. You almost bored me to death the first time. Ooh. Hey, Squibble's shop. This is cool. Have you got any, like, money around here, mate, that I can just, like, fucking rob whilst I'm smashing your shit up? Don't mind. Hey! Look, we found his coin jar. Excellent. Give me your coins. I said, give me your coins! You are broke. You need my business, sir. Uh-huh. You'd be foolish to take another step without some of my Alright, I'll bite. Oh, sure. Mother Nature provides for us all. She across your palm if you uproot her heli plants nearby. You wasted my time with that horse shit. Okay, well maybe we should uproot all of them. You never know. Of the mountain falls. I see you come in search of my invaluable advice. Yes. Oh, should we go on? No treasure chests can be smashed open with your bare hands. The ones holding the rarest treasures will need a more explosive solution. Yeah, I know that. I am indeed the renowned. Sure. 
There are magical signposts hidden throughout the land. Follow the clues they give you, and you'll surely be rewarded. Uh huh. Fuck, buddy, you're getting way expensive. There are many deserted huts on the Badlands. Their owners left many treasures behind when they fled. Hmm. A young traveler. Go on. The cave that once housed the finest treasures still contains secrets, but you'll need to dig deep and get your feet wet to find your reward. I've nothing left to teach you. Good, because you fucking robbed me blind, you bastard. Gave me nothing but shit in return. What a dick. I wonder if we dig up these heli plants. I wonder if there might be a fruit. Well, you know, we found some money. And a heart. I don't need a heart. Yeah, I don't buy that. That wasn't exactly a shop. At least not a shop in the manner that I like. No blackjack and hookers for us today. Ooh, we'll take the coins. What else we got? A big old load of nothing. We don't like having a big old load of nothing. Well, that was a waste of time. I want my like hundred bucks back. Hey, man, enjoy it what you can. Soon you'll be put to work in the mines, and then you'll beg for just one more chance to come and have a carefree swim around this place. Ooh, interesting. Howdy. Buzz off. off, fucking bitch. Should slap your ass. Ooh. Well, that's to return home, which we obviously can't do. Hello. Well, at least you're friendly. You get uh, props for that. I have explosives. Ooh. Cool. So, can we, like, I wonder, how do we move these? Because we can't kick them, but we can, ooh, oh, you fool of a took. You can light these, you just can't seem to, like, smack them around, which is a little bit weird. I guess we can't destroy those. Which is fine. I wonder if we flame this thing more. Can we make it like explode quicker? Apparently not. Unless we need a certain type of beastie. Oh. Oh, that's spicy. Yeah, that doesn't do nothing. I guess we need uh, maybe major ruin or something. Out of the way, jackass. So we need to go to the top. I guess we can explore this place once we get Major Ruin. Let's go get our new buddy. Hello. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh -huh. All right, all right, mate. All right, all right, all right. All right in the back. All right in the back. All right, Mr. Troll. Ooh, that looks spiky. Oh, advanced technique. Rock creatures like this can be shattered with an explosion. Use the boom root plant to break up the rocks you need. Ah, okay. Um, silly woman. Supposed to use your flying ability. Yes, yes. Let's try that, shall we? Come on, baby. Wow, there's a hell of a fuse on these things. I've said that once, I'll say it again. But Jesus. Uh, Rubble can collect certain rocks and tow them behind him. Oh. Okay, that's that's quite cool. It's going to be... Ah, oh, wow. It's going to be a little bit annoying, I think, if we've got to keep doing that. But cool nonetheless. Oi, what are you doing? I'm guessing, yeah, we probably need a different beastie to do that. Uh, rubble. 
All right, well, let's keep this party wagon rolling. These spikes look really unpleasant. It's got to be said, these spiky boulders. I wouldn't really want to walk across them myself, but hey. What do I know? You know? What do I know? Hey, pal. That sound feels good. Does it, bro? Are the rock tie spirits are scared away, and the rocks brought back here. It doesn't look like any of us will be getting into the cave. Well, you should be thankful I'm here then, I guess. Okay, I don't think we actually brought that many back, but hey ho, whatever. Hi, right, friend. This is the Shrine of Love, <coughs> our famous monument. It can, or at least it could have been seen for miles around. But now, the torch is. Ew, it, it's, too up it's too upsetting. Oh. Well, we know we can sort these bad boys out. Okay. Ah. Is that lit? No. I'm in trouble lighting that one. Dude, that one is not easy to light. You lit now? Huh. Okay. Yeah, you have to... Unless we have to light them in order, perhaps. Maybe. Doesn't make a lot of sense, though. Hmm. Very strange. This one's going to be a dick to light, I think. Yeah, this is going to be a dick and a half. Unless we can get in here another way, which is quite possible. Is there a back way in? Hmm. Well, I don't know if there's a back way in, but... Ooh. How's that? I don't know. Maybe we can do something with that with... Uh... Ooh, hello. Ah, okay. Maybe you can light them in any order you want. Can we, like, get some fire in this angle? It's actually really hard to aim this guy. Doesn't look like it. Seagulls up there. Any more up here? No. Okay. Oh, look, health. Sweet. Just what we wanted. Some orgasmic juice. Orgasm juice. Let's not think about that too much. Ah, hello. Oh, we're in another part. Sweet. Two more to find. Aha. Uh -huh. There we are. Nice. One more to find. I think uh, that last one to find was around the other side, maybe? Maybe not. Hmm. And you guys really couldn't figure this out. Seriously. Although, we've got an impossible task now. We've got to find out where the last one is. God damn it. So that one's lit, that one's lit. There's literally one more of these things somewhere. So you're not actually gonna give us any information. So the Shrine of Light, there's gotta be one more bloody dragon skull somewhere. Aha! Aha! There you are! There you are, you son of a bitch. You stupid son of a bitch. Alright. God damn it. Of course. Why would it be easy? It's never easy. 
I suppose if it was easy, it would be worth doing yada yada yada. But still, for God's sake, sometimes I like it when it's easy. Ooh, you, oof, fuck. That was dodgy. I mean, that was totally fine. Woohoo! Ooh, that's a big boy. This is all I have to offer, apart from my undying gratitude. Well. Thank you so much. You can keep your undying gratitude, my man. But I'll have that fruit. Cheers, buddy. Just what I wanted. Yeah, we've got like ten fruit now. Damn. I'll tell Pacifica that she can start sending tourists our way. Thanks again. You're most welcome, my man. Enjoy. It's uh, certainly a lot brighter around here. And I'll tell you what, my friend, you know what to do if the lights ever go out again. Anyway, guys, we're going to end this video here. When we return, we're going to go and hopefully find another elemental warrior. Major ruin. And with any luck, we'll be able to level him up straight away again. We've almost found half the elixirs of life, which is cool. And we're a good chunk through the fruit as well. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. And as always, yeah, till next time.